What it all comes down for, for me as a sommelier, is the fact that I love wine. I want to share my love for wine with our guests and that is why we have spent so much time during the last year searching through all the importers around the world, auction houses and, and you know everywhere, basically everywhere, to try to, to source the wines that we want to offer our guests. What has been very important for me as well is also to find uh, back vintages, older vintages. We don't just want the latest vintage, we want the, the library, if you will, of different regions that are classic ones, but also some regions that are might not as famous, but we want to showcase that to our guests and, and bring our love for wine when it comes to, to the food and, and the wine together, joining that in the service experience as well. We have really spent the last year digging deep into the sake style, the how you serve it, the traditions behind it, but mainly because we feel like the pairing with the friends and food together with sake is, uh, is really perfect, blends perfectly together with the harmony, the acidity in the sake, which is somewhat lower than in wine. So we think we're gonna be able to show our guests some really exciting uh, flavor combinations when it comes to the food and the beverage pairings. One of the things that has been very important is that we don't just want to mimic a white wine or a red wine when it comes to the non-alcoholic. We want them to stand by themselves. We want uh, the pairing to be so perfect that you may want to try it even though you're having a glass of wine as well. So that is something that has been a critical point when we have uh, developed the non-alcoholic program.